Ryan Jones and I'm playing Sandra Gangel. It was the very first time, because I've been filming Scott and Bailey, so it's the very first time that I actually, Sandra, came out of my mouth, um, so to speak. And, and it was interesting kind of listening to my son, actually looking at um, my son who's uh, 15 and thinking, God, how did that work? But that's okay. And, uh, and we were all um, really flying off each other and, and it, yeah, it was great, exciting. For many reasons, I think um, Jonathan's writing is beautiful and I think the love story is beautiful and I think a love story speaks to everybody. I have uh, a lot of gay friends and, and I think it's very important that this is a story that is about two young boys falling in love and from my point of view, the world that Sandra kind of creates for them, which is quite a free, um, even though she's got a hard edge to her, she um, has this young toy boy who's also quite a free spirit. Um, She's funny, she's smart, she's aspirational, and I think that all those things kind of allow the backdrop of this wouldn't have been able to, those two boys wouldn't have been able to sleep to and tell and find themselves if Sandra's world wasn't free. And I think that um, she kind of allows them to do that without even knowing it, really. I think. A play should be about um, shutting off any noise that's going on in your day-to-day -day life and, and you should experience and feel and, um, and it, should, it should do something to you and I think that I would challenge anyone to come to Beautiful Thing and not have it make them feel something and not have them walk away having had an experience and I think that I've spoken to a lot of people that saw a play 20 years ago um, that are then going to come back and see this play and it really made an impact on them and um, whether you're living through something uh, like Jamie and Steve are or not I think um, I think it will change you in some way and that's a good play for me. Happy anniversary, beautiful thing. <laughs>